Hey everybody, it's your boy Chicken, coming at you again a little bit late with my video this week. Uh, had some life stuff happening uh, and needed to focus on a couple of uh, job related items and uh, yeah, so now we're here a couple days late. Uh, anyway, one of the videos I was excited to put out was um, a couple of them uh, regarding court missions. Uh, today's video we're going to go into how to use the court mission system uh, to pay your pilots SRP. All right, let's get into it. As a member, you're going to go into the corp um, window and then click on view missions and market. Um, that's going to go ahead and pull up the next screen. Uh, and in here, uh, you can see all the stuff going on. But what we want to do is press publish missions for yourself. Uh, it's a little confusing, but this is how you as a player send a mission to the corporation. You're going to request for reimbursement. Honestly, I don't know if the other one does anything different, but um, in here, uh, I was on the line with him and I was kind of walking him through it because he had never done it before. Um, He's typing in the uh, mission intro area. This is where you can say your message to the people who are approving or denying it. Um, I can't remember. I think I told him to just type in SRP or in a video with chicken. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so in the next section below that, it'll say, what do you get? Do you get ISK? Do you get corp pointy things? Or do you get uh, an item? In this instance, uh, since we're talking about SRP, we're going to be giving the pilot back the ISK in order for him to get the Plex back. I can't just give him Plex. Um, so uh, I think it came out to, we just picked some random ship for him. It came out to 169 million. Um, of course, he typed it wrong the first time. <laughs> uh, and then uh, once he's done with this portion, uh, I can't remember if he clicked around a lot or not. Uh, but the next thing you want to do is publish mission, uh, publish member mission. Um, now this doesn't let anyone see it except the corporation. It's as though you created a mission for the corporation to accept. Um, and when he does it, oh. I guess he's clicking around, checking out some of the other options. You know, you can set the location, where it has to be, all that stuff. We're not doing that because we just want the ISK and the location doesn't really matter. And that's how you do the player side. Once the player mission is com uh, submitted, it then takes, um, in our corporation, we have it set to director level, but anyone with the permission to accept uh, missions uh, with the ISK permission. They just added separate permissions for ISK and points. Make sure your corp leader or the directors who have the ability to set the perms take the time to set those perms correctly for anyone currently managing uh, these items. Uh, my portion of the video was recorded before this morning's patch, so uh, I don't know if that specific look has changed. Um, but I know the process wouldn't. Basically, you have the permission to click the button. Let us let me show you how. For right hand corner, you don't see this toggle switch because you don't have the superpower, but there's a, a face icon and you touch it and it switches to the corp icon. Um, and then uh, the second tab down is membership applications. Um, under court missions and this is the court mission that you just created because uh, it gives you the title the publisher the t label type it is and then the total so like if I had five ships and you only turned in two for a court mission or something I don't know um, uh, but anyway I would click on the one that I'm, I'm interested in taking care of so request for reimbursement uh, double check my numbers if they match because we were on comps and um, this gives me these choices if I click on record it'll tell me how many times this contract has been accepted or refused and since it's only set for one player one time you have the SRP amount that he was told on discord to pay 
And there you have it. Special shout out to Meow Wolf for uh, recording the player viewpoint on that. I wanted to make sure that we got both the how to do it on the player side and how to do it on the uh, for our, our corp director side. Uh, so, yeah, and uh, something else that uh, kind of uh, caught caught my attention in a surprise way. It wasn't a surprise, but uh, at the same time, it was cool. Uh, you can completely avoid taxes by doing this, and it becomes instant. Um, in the next video, you, uh, I'll go over how you and people in your corp uh, can avoid taxes when trading ISK between alts. Um, if you want to uh, buy an item, the only catch is they all kind of have to be in a corp. If you think about it, you might realize how to do it. Anywho, in the next video, right here, uh, you should be able to uh, watch that. Thanks again for stopping by. It's your boy Chicken. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe because your boys try to be a super content creator.